How's it going YouTube? Spike Smith here, chilling with fantastic, amazing news. Now, I heard uh, maybe a month or so ago that NASA was planning to make a big announcement. They were announcing an announcement, right? And I believe that was today, and I think this is what that was referring to. NASA made a big announcement. They discovered a new form of life different than what we know of as life. Not alien life. This is unfortunately still an Earth creature, but... What it means is it's, uh, in the article they say, it basically expands the definition for life, and in conjecturing that, uh, you know, that uh, life does not have to form on planets that are just like Earth. There can be a, a lot of different kinds of chemistry, and life could still arise. So I'm going to read some bits of it, and I'm going to link it down below. Um, so here, here it starts. NASA has discovered a new life form, a bacteria called GFAJ1, that is unlike anything currently living um, on planet Earth. It's capable of using arsenic to build its DNA, RNA, proteins, and cell membranes. This changes everything. So yeah, in DNA, um, they use uh, phosphorus on the you know the outer spiral parts. Uh, there's a really cool animation on the site linked again. Um, <clears throat> And basically, um, uh, phosphorus on the periodic table has real sim similar properties to arsenic. And amazingly, this creature can actually use the arsenic, which is poisonous to just about any other kind of life form, or normal life forms. It can actually substitute it in, and it uses arsenic. So, I wonder if the bug itself is fucking poisonous. Anyway, it's just a bacteria from Mono Lake. Um, yeah, so it's a big deal. It basically me. I'm pretty much convinced that there is other life somewhere in the, in the universe, just be based on the scope. And apparently now, what we thought was the definition of life, what we used to call it, is a lot broader than we've thought. So it definitely means that, you know, life can form in a lot of different environments. Um, yeah, that's all. Read the fucking article. It's awesome. Check out the animation. It's pretty dope. Uh, yes, hail science!